Then why would you want to use a, uh, button? Then why would you want to use a button knife to, um, kill somebody? Well, they, you would have to thrust pretty damn hard. <laughs> <laughs> well, why would you want to use a sharp knife on a cake? Well, that all depends. Why do most five-star companies use a chef's knife to cut a cake? True. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to part four. <laughs> the twist of my black play too. Uh we're now going to enter the present ship. The present ship is an interesting kind of level. This is also where we will get uh, the third of the four secret characters. The present ship is a mandatory is a mandatory level. You cannot choose anything else out of this one. This level in question is split into three parts. The very first part, you're starting off in the cabin. Once the game actually loads the next part, the doors will open. That's why right when the second out of three parts kick into play. Now you're exploring the, uh, essentially the poop deck of the, uh, the shit deck, excuse me. The poop deck of the, um, well, the deck in particular, like what's going to happen right now, of the ship. So now we are looking at just basically the deck. Right now, the ship is still at seas. Eventually, it's going to, um, eventually, it's going to, um, arrive at shore somewhere. And thus, the entirety of the level opens up. You can actually, uh, shock these people to that. I believe I just did that. Oh, well, there we go! There we go, see? We just executed essentially three criminals. All for the malicious fun. You'll know when the uh, dirt pond opens up, the uh, cargo hold opens up. If anyway, well, I think it's supposed to be cells. This is a prison ship. I have no idea what that guy just said. And there goes dark side. <laughs> I kind of wish that I could add in that voice clip from, um... I kind of wish I could add in a uh, voice clip of, um... Yeah, here we go. Here's the third part of the waffle. This is the final part. That opens up. I kind of wish I can uh, insert that voice clip from Twist Metal 2012. <laughs> that would be amazing. <laughs> it's not really part of the game itself, but... But that would be amazing, just like all of a sudden you hear Dark Side destroyed. Seven enemies left. Or seven enemies we bank. Yeah, this is where you would get I believe it's Manswar here. So by process of elimination. You would get you don't, yeah, that's the shield I accidentally activated. So by process of elimination, I would get essentially yellow jacket if I were to open up this area. I think I do manage to actually open up this area. Now you do have to be a little bit on the careful side because you can completely destroy this makeshift ramp that you can make here.
thus screwing over your chances of getting a secret character. Open it up. You can open up the cargo hole. And you did see it too. You did see like a little bit of a flash of where the door is. I think at some point I do say, ah, oh, screw it, let's just get this waffle done and over with. I'm not entirely sure on that. Is that the next waffle, the waffle that I am feeling? Here we go! Finally, I think I get to show off one of the secret areas. And we show off one secret area. There we go! Yeah, I believe I only unlocked this character because the control panel is gone. But I do believe it's either Manslaughter or Warthog that appears in this area. I'm pretty damn sure it's Manslaughter. I do love Manswar's um, ending. I really do love that. I love that ending in this game. It's hilarious. <laughs> if you want, I can spoil it. Ah, the hell with it. I'm not gonna show it off. Besides, you can check out all the endings on YouTube anyways. Black's ending consists of him working for Coepso because, you know, he won the contest, right? Coepso is nowhere to be seen. Instead, what he finds is the entire drone that Coepso sits on at the end of each story is covered with bombs, and one of the bombs is a sticky note in front of it that says, screw you, love Coepso. And then the bomb blows up in front of Black's face. It's hilarious. <laughs> I just love that ending. Okay, so. Are we almost done? That the music did not change to a much more tense version. I take it that we still have about at least two more cars, if not more. So we still got a little bit to go. Oh, well kill got destroyed. Okay. Somebody just got blown up by one of my missiles. Find the music. I'm still not done. Who the hell am I missing? I'm missing somebody. Question them. Wow! Okay. Okay, now I'm down to the last vehicle. I do have a random question though. 
before we move on to the next level, uh, or the next fail, I should say. Now... Is it possible that you can die just by getting backed up into? It's always been that thing in the Twisted Metal series. It's always been a thing in the Twisted Metal series. You can possibly die when you get backed up by a car. When a car backs up into you, usually it's quite slow. But is it really possible to die from it? I'm not entirely sure about that. Oh no, I'm not gonna test it! <laughs> That's something that, uh... You could possibly do on Myth Busters, as if it actually is a myth. For the works of things, I might be doing one more level. I'm not sure. If somebody could leave at the comments if it's entirely possible to die just by getting back... By, uh, getting a car backed up into you. Oh, oh, I forgot about this set of waffles. Both of these waffles are pretty small and compact. The one we're going to tackle, Black Rock Ridge, as opposed to Black Rock Stadium. Black Rock Ridge is a nasty little waffle. Everything is icy. Everything is icy. But again, this entire area is pretty compact, so prepare for a lot of chaos. Has there always been a... Has there always been like a multi... Has there always been like an icy level of some sort? If I could get by... English, right? Why well, is there always an icy level in the Twisted Metal games? Because we have icy. We have. I gotta stop saying the word icy. Maybe I. Maybe I'm hankering for an icy in 7 Eleven. Maybe that's why I'm saying it all the time. I want that goddamn sword beat, damn it. Um, has there always been a snowy level? Cause towards the mile two, it was hard to go. Woo! Towards the mile two, it's Antarctica. This game, it's snowy roads. We oh god, damn it! Ow! Thank you, music, for making my death epic. <laughs> Actually, this level's music is really saddening. Finally done with that. Oh boy. Huh. Wow. I told you that the snowy waffles were going to be a little bit on the hectic side. Now did I? See you in part five. <laughs>